The overall goal of this experimental approach is to investigate the immune response to urinary tract infection and to permit direct comparison between male and female animals. This method can help answer key questions of mucosal immunology related to how males and females respond to urinary tract infection. The main advantage is that infection is established via the natural route. We first had the idea for this method after noting how often it is stated that the installation of the bladder of male mice is impossible. Though this method will provide insight into urinary tract infection, it can also be applied to other disease studies, such as bladder cancer. To begin, prepare one pediatric intravenous access cannula for each group of mice to be infected. Using the inbuilt spring mechanism, divest each cannula of its needle as instructed by the manufacturer. Discard the needles, preserving only the plastic intravenous cannula. Sterilize the catheters in a laminar flow hood for one UV cycle of approximately 25 to 30 minutes. After growing an overnight culture of uropathogenic E. coli, or UPEC, according to the text protocol, spin the bacterial suspension in a tabletop microcentrifuge at 17,000 times G for one minute, and resuspend the resulting bacterial pellet at 2 times 10 to the 8th CFU per milliliter in PBS. Serially dilute an aliquot of suspension and plate on LB agar with antibiotics if appropriate to determine the exact inoculum for each infection. Draw the bacterial inoculum into a 1 milliliter syringe and attach the catheter to the end of the syringe. Tap the syringe to remove any air and depress the...